Hi there again guys, this is Kevin Smith with First Team Real Estate here in Southern California and here we have Dave Marzinki with Movement Mortgage and he's going to be telling us a little bit about a self-employed employed loan, program. loan program. Okay, great. Yeah. So with things coming back from COVID and the mortgage space expanding a little bit more, uh, a lot of our non-QM or our alternative documentation lenders have come back strong and the interest rates are very attractive for uh, self-employed borrowers. And what this consists of is using your bank statements instead of your tax returns for a self-employed borrower to qualify for a loan. Uh, we have a lot of great success with this program. It helps increase your purchasing power because we all know self-employed individuals take the deductions that they're allowed on their tax returns, but that doesn't reflect their true income from their business. Yeah. And so with these bank statement programs, we take a look at your overall deposits from your businesses, and then we actually come up with an expense factor to determine your qualifying income, and we can qualify you for the different loan program. And with as little as 10% down, we can get yeah. you, a, with no PMI, we can get you into a home uh, with this specific program. That's great. Now, do you have to be employed for a certain amount of time? Like if you just started a business, do you have yeah. to have be in business for a certain amount of time? Great question. So we do have to have two years of uh, ownership on that business. So you have to have you know, two-year history of being self-employed. Okay. And then does it have to be, like, can it be, well, self-employed, but can it be an LLC, a corporation yeah. kind of thing? Yeah, okay. exactly. So just anything. Yeah. Okay, great. And another uh, benefit to this, too, is that we can actually take title of the home in the name of the business if we want to. Uh, either in the LLC or the name of a corporation. So there's some advantages to that. Cool. So love to talk to you more about that. So this situation applies to you. Yeah, so it doesn't sound like it does have to be a primary? Can it be? No, it can be uh, investment property, investment second home, awesome. yeah. primary residence, all of the above. So. Great. That's yeah. a fantastic program. Yeah. All right. Well, if you need more information, of course, you can reach out to us uh, either by phone, text, or email. You can look for our contact information below. Thank you again, Dave. Yeah, thanks Great for having program. me on, Kevin. I appreciate it. And we'll see you all next week. Take care. Bye-bye.